Oh no, say it ain't so. Kodak Black is going back to jail again. There's a warrant um, issued out for his arrest after a failed fentanyl laced drug test. In Broward County, Kodak Black is wanted by the police in Florida after violating his bail condition after a failed drug test, according to legal documents obtained. TMZ. A warrant out for his out for the 25 year old arrest signed off by a judge in Broward County on Thursday, with paperwork being filed on Saturday. The warrant state that the sheriff deputies have the authority to take Kodak Black, whose name is Dusan Octave, in the custody if they encounter him. The law enforcement believes that the Pompano native failed a drug test on February the 8th. This result shows traces of fentanyl, the highly potent synthetic opioid that has claimed the lives of fellow rappers Mac Miller, Juice World, and Lil Pete. Kodak reportedly has failed to report for a random drug test a week earlier on February the 3rd and did not submit a sample. If he's caught, there's additional order to hold the sniper gremlin hitmaker without bond until his next hearing in the drug possession and trafficking case that briefly landed him behind bars last year. Black was arrested in Florida in July 2022 after police discovered 30 oxycodone pills and almost 75,000 in cash in his dog Durango in a traffic stop. Cops say um, his tag and license were expired in a series of since deleted tweet shortly after his arrest, Yak ridiculously called them Pinky D. Police offered to cuff him and claim he pulled him over simply so he could cop a fill of his BD. Yes, my daughter talks about it so much I had to pull it, pull him over so I can feel it. No lie, bro felt like he had been in the front. Fuck it. He's he, he's equipped, um, imitating the cop's voice. His attorney Bradford Cohen, meanwhile, claimed the drugs that were seized during the um, arrest was legally prescribed. Cohen said the client has a um, battle of chronic pain since he's been shot in the leg in February in the year, and the painkillers were necessary to treat the injuries. Cohen also argued that there was nothing illegal about the money discovered in Yak's vehicle. He comes with the territory of being a successful musician who is often paid in cash and needs large sum of uh, amount of money for several tour expenses due to the lengthy criminal record, which included a first degree assault and a battery convention along with a drug and weapons offense. Kodak Black was placed under house arrest after person a $225,000 surety bond. A judge also ordered him to submit a drug Wear GPS ankle monitoring from home or less medical reasons for court appointments or employment. Yak need to get itself together because this stuff is not going to stop. You know? And a person of his caliber who always getting these opportunities keep going to jail. What do you expect? I hope these young brothers are listening. This rap play and I'm out.